and welcome to all my dear lovely students. I hope you all are doing well at home. You are doing your homework, learning the lessons and giving equal importance to each and every subject. Yes, so let's get going with our EBS subject. We have started with lesson number 6, clothes. Before going forward, let's recall what we have learned. So, before recalling, let's have a question answer round. Okay, I'll ask a simple question. Let's start with a simple question. Have you ever heard about this famous dialogue? Insan ki teen zarurat hoti hai. Roti, kapda, makan. Roti, the food we eat. That we have studied in lesson number 4. Kapda, the clothes. We are studying right now. Makan, houses. We have studied in lesson number 5. So we are going to study about clothes. We have started it yesterday. Let's quickly recall page number 164 which was given as homework to you and I hope you all have done the homework well. Good students. So let's recall. We have started with a pink box, warm-up box. That was a puzzle box and in which few hidden spellings were there. We had to find out the spellings with the clues given. What was the clue? There were four pictures of four types of clothes like shirt, tie, coat and socks. So we have done it successfully and then we proceeded to for a question that was why do we wear clothes and I know you all must be knowing this answer. The answer to this so let's say it together. We wear clothes because it protects us from heat, cold, rain, insect bites and small injuries. What are injuries? When you get hurt, that part is called injured part and this is called an injury. So that is total in Hindi. So this was the answer. I hope you all have said together or repeated after me. So, next topic what we have studied, we have studied about types of clothes. And in types of clothes, the first question was, what do you wear when you go to school? Or which clothes do we wear when we go to school? And the answer to this is uniform. We wear uniform when we go to school. What is the spelling of uniform? U-N-I-F-O-R-M Uniform. And what was the other type of clothes we have studied? The other type of clothes was the clothes that we wear when we go for an outing, when we go for parties, when we go for weddings, when we have some celebrations in which we feel comfortable we feel comfortable and which we look very beautiful, handsome, smart, attractive. So what are those type of clothes called? Those clothes are called formal clothes. Your jeans, your t-shirts, your fancy frocks, the lehenga, sherwanis that we like to wear and we feel comfortable in that. So that type of clothes are called formal clothes. So we, yesterday we did with these two topics. Today we will proceed with a new topic about clothes. Page number 165. Clothes in different seasons. Now you must have seen and noticed as well that in different seasons we wear different clothes. Did you ever thought why do we wear different clothes in different seasons? Why can't we wear same as we are wearing right now shorts and t-shirts? Why can't we wear this the whole 12 months in a year? Even if it is rainy season, even if it is winter season. Or why can't we wear raincoat the whole 12 months from January to December? So here we are going to study about all this. Why we are wearing different clothes in different seasons. So I am going to show you a picture through which we are going to understand today's topic. 
here's the picture can you see what can you see here a sun the sun is shining very bright very very bright it's a hot and sunny day so which season is this yes you guessed it right it's the summer season in summer season we like to wear these kind of clothes let's name them t-shirt shorts frock skirts and why do you think we wear these type of clothes because these clothes make us feel cool in summer we feel very hot and we like to have cool drinks we like to have area i like to sit in front of coolers acs and we like to have something that relaxes us we have watermelons mangoes so we want to feel cool so we wear these types of dresses also so that our body remains cool how does the body remains cool because these clothes are made up of cotton do you know what is cotton i'll show you this is cotton yes this is cotton what you call ruy in hindi so this cotton is very light very light you can easily take it it flies in air okay when it is uh, a windy day you can see the cotton will fly so that is very light and with this cotton our summer clothes are made so these clothes are called cotton clothes the clothes that we wear in summer are called cotton clothes yes so summer in summer which kind of clothes we wear in summer cotton clothes and now you must all be knowing what is cotton this is cotton with this the summer clothes are made so these clothes are called cotton clothes and why do we wear cotton clothes because they make us feel cool so let's move to the next season let's see which is the next season yes what can you see here dark clouds raining heavily and a person is wearing what is this the same cloth that we wear in winters or in summers no he is wearing a rain coat but why is he wearing a rain coat and not he is wearing a short or t-shirt or a jeans why is not wearing such kind of thing why is covered with rain coat because rain coat protect us from rain yes so that we cannot we do not get wet we do not get to wet in this rain so we wear rain coat so in rainy season which type of clothes do we wear in rainy season or what do we wear in rainy season we wear in rainy season we wear rain coat we all know about rain coat yeah. we all are using rain coat in the rainy season yes what is the next type of season which is the next season winter season yes you can see the moon because the sun is not there the moon is here snow is there and you can see which type of clothes these are sweaters woolen caps gloves mufflers and why do we wear sweaters these type of clothes in winter because in winter we feel very cold right and our body needs heat our body needs warm so we wear these type of clothes these type of clothes are thick and they provide heat to our body so that we do not feel cold in winter season and this is made up of wool the sweaters woolen caps gloves mufflers your jackets your woolen socks these are made up of wool so these are called woolen clothes and woolen clothes keep us warm keep our body heat okay gives our body heat so 
we are going to write winter season now in winter season we wear woolen clothes and what are these woolen clothes made up of woolen clothes are made up of wool like cotton clothes are made up of cotton woolen clothes are made up of wool and from where do we get wool there's a famous poem you all have learned this in your nursery class so let's sing together ba ba black sheep have you any wool yes sir yes sir three packs full so why we are asking the sheep to give us wool because sheep give us wool we get the wool from sheep wool makes the woolen cloth it is very really thick cloth and it provides warm to our body provide warm to our body so we wear woolen clothes in winter season that's why we have different clothes in different season in summer we want to be cool to remain cool we wear cotton clothes in rainy season so that we can do not get drenched or wet in rain we wear rain coat in winter season we wear woolen clothes that keep our body warm that provide heat to our body so we have studied cotton clothes rain coat woolen clothes different season different clothes now you must have understood why we wear different clothes and why what is the reason we wear different clothes in different season now these clothes we, the clothes are made up of three things okay first we have learned the summer clothes that is made up of cotton cotton silk and wool these are the three things out of which our clothes are made cotton you have seen your summer clothes there are short skirts your t-shirts so these are made up of cotton and we use these cotton clothes in summer season silk the best example is your mom sarees the mom sarees are the heavy sarees which are very shining these sarees are made up of silk wool woolen clothes that is your sweater your socks woolen socks mufflers jackets that is made up of wool so today we have studied about different clothes in different season and the three things from which the clothes are made so students today's homework will be you will be reading page number 165 understanding the topics and tomorrow we will be back to learn a new topic more about clothes till then bye take care